to create or edit a menu bar, what you need to do is to go to more and then select add the site, uh, add the site layout and then you can just click on this plus sign and uh, select the navigation uh, element okay but let's say you, you accidentally take click on some something else okay there are lots of different uh, elements that you can choose from if you accidentally click on something else that you, you don't want to uh, you don't really want to use all you have to do is to come back to this element and click on this cross uh, the icon and it will delete it it will let you delete it okay and now I click on this plus sign again the element that I want to use is called navigation okay I'll click on navigation and after I you know I, I click on that uh, the navigation element is created on the side for me and now what I have to do is to click on that and then uh, I can create the items that I want to have uh, under this navigation element and I want uh, that this I want to ha that have some links to the, the different web pages that I have already created so I will click on add page and after that uh, I will select the page that I have created and all the pages that I have created uh, are listed here if you have not created a page yet uh, it will not be shown here and so in order for you to create a menu uh, bar item you know to a page inside your website you have to cre first create that uh, web page first and in this case I have created graphing page so I select the graphing page and I need to scroll down to the bottom and click OK and uh, let me create uh, add one more page and uh, the other page that I want to uh, have on my menu is intervent is called intervention video. I also go to the bottom and click OK, and then click OK again. And now these two buttons uh, are selected, you know, and show up on my menu. And if I click on close on top, you see, okay, right now uh, these two are the uh, menu items on my navigation. If I click on uh, graphing. You go to my graphing page, but since my graphing page does not have any content yet, and it will just show me a blank page, and same thing with the intervention, uh, the video page, and if I want to go to the uh, the the home page, I'll click here, and it will bring me back to the home page. Now let me show you one more uh, uh, the type of menu that you can create. Uh, let me go to go back to edit site layout again and click on the plus sign and this time I will create another navigation uh, element I click on add it will add it to the bottom and then I can click on it to, to edit it and this time I'm going to call this uh, instead of calling it navigation I'm, to, I'm going to call this as IPT387 calls links okay and then underneath that, I want to have links to several different things on my uh, th that relates to my course. And so I will uh, click on add URL instead of add page because uh, those uh, things that I'm going to link to are not really web pages inside my website. They are links to uh, at other uh, the, the websites. And so I'll click on add URL. And the first one uh, that I'm going to add is called uh, course home page, and this is go going to be the uh, main page uh, in the uh, course website. And um, I have provided for you uh, in the uh, course uh, home page the URL, you know, for the, for this page. And so I just need to highlight it, and then I can go to edit and copy. Or the shortcut key for copy is Command C on the Apple or Control C on the PC. So I press the con Command uh, C and th to copy that URL. And here I can come back here and paste the URL and then click OK. And now I have the course homepage, and I will create another one called uh, see this another one that I. Uh, re require you uh, to have is the digital dialogue 
Okay. Spell correctly. And go to uh, the sites and copy. Oh, it should be this link. And copy this link and come back here and paste. Okay, and click OK again. And, and you can see how you can continue to create these uh, uh, links here. Yeah? And uh, let's say you have accidentally uh, mix, mix up the order of these menu items. All you have to do is to select the one that you want. So let's say I want digital dialog to be on top. I can just click on it and, and press this arrow. Okay, and it will move it up or move it down. Okay, and then when I'm done, um, I can just click OK. All right. And now I have uh, these items uh, right right there. And then when you are done, just click on close. And there you have your menu bar right there uh, working. And if uh, people come in and click on a certain link uh, in the menu bar, it will take them right uh, to, to the page that, that you want them to go to.